In the late 1900s, Nikola Tesla, engineer of futurist, predicted that in the not so distant future, we would be able to project any thought, any image on any screen, any place desired. He identified the revolution this would have on all social relations, and he could not have been more right. Of the world's 7.5 billion people, almost 40% of us are engaged in some form of social media each and every day. We are on the brink of a new technological and social revolution that will forever alter the way that we live, work, and relate to one another. Brands that are actively engaged with their consumers in an effective way in social media stand the most to win in this new economy. In a world where word of mouth travels the globe in a flash and brands are born or destroyed in a nanosecond. If you think where social started, right, you think about how that evolution has happened over time from creating textual content to creating pictures, creating videos, and then sharing it on the internet. And now we look at where social is, it's just part of our marketing channels. It's part of what we do. We're not only sharing content, we're engaging with content. It's really part of the customer journey. Social allows brands to evoke the passions and aspirations of their audience, and we know that an emotionally engaged audience both exposes and converts others. And great brands understand this and keep that in check. Social for our consumers and for the people around us, it's just what they do to discover, to learn, and to communicate. We always have to think about what's going to live on and what we want that conversation or what we want that legacy to be. Social is, is impacting every part of the media plan. How do we take content and use social media to accelerate that? A great example is one of our clients, Elevation. For one film in particular, we trialed uh, Snap. And we saw once we used the right content in the right environment, we achieved amazing results for the client. With Before I Fall, it's an overperformance of about 50%, which is uh, obviously makes us all really happy. Un avantage clé que les annonceurs recherchent, c'est la capacité de transposer des investissements en les réseaux sociaux dans des résultats d'affaires. C'est d'être capable d'avoir accès et souvent des accès exclusifs à des partenariats avec les joueurs, les grands joueurs médias et les grands joueurs technologiques. The challenge with social is that there's so much happening and it's moving so quickly. You saw Vine come and go. You see filters come and go. We bring a lot of expertise, whether that be through iProspect, ICUC, Isobar, Kara, all the way across. But to clients, it's just Dan. We recently launched the Lexus IS. The ad campaign is based off an insight about how autonomous driving will soon be here. So we had a journey on Instagram, the video on Facebook, canvas ads that gave people routes around their local regions. So engage our thrill of driving now. To do social right, you need to ensure that you're speaking with the consumer and not to them in a manner that's consistent with the environment and content in which they are consuming. Recently, one of the things we've done with Nestle and Nespresso is really understand how they can be most relevant within Canadian conversations. And we've built a social content studio that in real time allows us to take product, create content, get it into market, and then foster that conversation, seed that content in real time, and understand how people are interacting with the content, but also what's driving them to purchase. If you think about yesterday, there was less people on social than there were today. And there was less content created by the people than there were today. And let's think about a year from now, and five years from now, and 10 years from now. And that is not only a challenge, but it's also an opportunity. If you're not using social, you're missing out because your customers are.